Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be doing some micheladas with my wife, Mari Tutu Glam. Hey y'all, I'm so excited. It's actually <laughs> Saturday night, it is. and he told me, he's like, so do you wanna make these micheladas or not? I was like, yeah. yes. <laughs> so excited, you guys. With this coronavirus, honey, you cannot even go out right now, so. Not this coronavirus. I'm sure y'all know what coronavirus is. The real deal. About. Since the coronavirus, I can't do mukbangs anymore, so I'm, I'm doing micheladas. Oh God. No, I'm kidding. No, there's still food out there, but we actually got this from uh, this company right here. They sent it to us and we've they actually it had it before. Him. Yeah, they sent it to me. So, I'm sorry, I need to like <laughs> talk out. a lot because I know this is his channel, mm -hmm. but they sent it to him and it's so funny because I've seen a lot of people shout him out and I was kind of jealous that they sent it to him and not me. I'm just kidding. I but I was like fangirling. I'm like, oh my God, I can't believe they reached out to you because like I've actually always wanted to try that. Anyways, the point is, I was like, oh my god, we gotta make micheladas. Like, I'm so excited that they actually sent this to him because, like, I've seen, I've heard a lot about this. Well, um, we person. met him at um, one of Winnie's party. It was the, her, like, grand opening of the Nails Hall place. Yeah, one of my friends had a yeah. grand opening. And, and we were talking to him for a good little minute, and then recently he just hit me up and told me, like, I gotta send this to you, blah, blah. And I was like, do it. I'm so freaking so down. excited. And I haven't dr done a drinking video in a good minute. If you guys have been subscribed to me for a good little while, you guys know, like, I used to do, like, drinking videos with my buddy Anthony. Let's do these We're micheladas. excited, you guys. It's Saturday night. It's about to get lit. <laughs> I personally love micheladas, like, in the summer. So I haven't had take micheladas real quick. in forever, but I'm excited. And they did send them over this cup. So yeah, well, they sent these, really, really but cute. we also got these already. But I do definitely think it's a vibe to, like, do it, like, on some glass cups, you know? Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. I don't know how long we've had these cups for. Okay, but I feel like I've had them forever. My mom, they're my mom's. But I feel like everybody has these kind of cups, right? Yeah. Just do a little model moment. I can't. Also, if you guys want to check this out, I'm going to have the link down in the description if you guys want to check out his IG. Ooh, look at that. I forgot to cheers with you. Oh my God. Wow. How rude. Oh my God. Can we tell them how we didn't have lemon? Mm. <clears throat> Some of you guys know this. We have like full on trees in the backyard and all that, but there was no lemon. And then we also checked both of the fridges, zero lemon. I'm gonna actually do this one first. The last time I made my michelada, I think when I would make them during the summer, well, you know, I, I make it seem like I drink micheladas like every time, but I don't. But the last time I was really getting into them was in summer. I was already having them back to back. And I think I was using Glam Tender's mix. You guys should also follow Glam Tender. She did have her own mix, right? Yeah. And I, I had to use her mix, but I've also, I think I also added clamato. Shake, shake, shake. Or no, they were. Well, this one's like uh -huh. legit ready to go. Like, okay. Boom. Yeah, I'm getting confused. I think you actually just use it, just that and beer. And then you yeah. put your little thing on side. I'll just tell you, you can also, even like with a spoon, go around it on the Corona. You know what's crazy? Why didn't we get modelos? Why did we get Corona? Leave me alone, bro. I don't know. I feel like you would like that better. Ain't that weird? Yeah, you nah. know what? I feel like we're gonna save these cups for my video, right? If you want, we could do totally just do these on top of Yeah, I think we're gonna actually do these cups. We might use these for my video because I actually do want to do a little drinking Q&A on mine since we're already here anyways. Oh my god, I have a little hair on my lips. Do you guys hate that? You're gonna make you a drink or Your not? Your lipstick is no. like in the way. Okay, let me Ooh, make my that. drink. Do, 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 do. I want mine to be like cold. Nobody come at me for not Let's having a see. perfect pour. Or whatever. I like when it's like poured. Like, oh, this is some trash. Hold on. It's you like, want to get it like feel filled? Dip, dip, sis. When like it's like inside like crazy. Gosh, you fing around and I saw all that. Great. I only got some here. Whatever. That's fine. Oop. <laughs> Mm. Okay. Oh, you haven't even poured that, man. You put this first or I'm the over beer? Here waiting I think for I you. put this first, right? I think I need a side beer because you said it can get too long. Come to the one that's too late. Like, oh, right there, right there. That's cool. Okay. Salud. Ooh. They say you have to tilt your cup so it won't, like, foam up. And go this. Yes. <clears throat> Cheers. Boom. Mmm. Oh, this is so bomb. Hello, bomb. Um, you see that drip? That's everything. Let's do a little, um, I don't know. Oh, yeah. Oh, should we grab some, like, Grab some of and put them up here. I mean, Corona. Once again, try to get that thumbnail. Okay. Oh, my God. This is so freaking good, guys. 
I love it. I don't know why I just prefer them for summer. Like any other time of year, I'm not like a. Well, no, yeah. actually, not no, that I it, don't prefer it. Hits, it hits different but during it hits summer. Different. Like, yeah, definitely. If somebody made me this every day, I would, I would drink it. Yeah, it's bomb. Mmm. Oh, I forgot to sign this my phone. It'll be going off every now and then. Okay, so you know how it drips? I love it. We love a little Instagram post, right? Yeah, just a little, you know. It. But when you're actually drinking, like I'll be licking it off. Mmm. And you know what's funny? I was never really into micheladas. Well, I think it's the whole clamato thing. Why do you say Mi like clamato? It's clamato. Clamato, okay. <laughs> I feel like I just never was into it. Mainly because it was just, it tasted like pure tomato to me. Until people started doing like things like this, like the mm -hmm. whole actual mix. It started just... Game changer. Yeah, definitely. Because before it was just... You grab your beer and Did we clamato. Shake it before we put it. Yeah. Before it was just grab your beer and some clamato, and I don't know, it just didn't hit as good as this, you know? This game changer. And also, I think this is, I'm not sure if it's his smallest size. I don't know, but he even does like a full on gallon one. Love that for us. Honestly, just drinking this, I'm just like, I can't wait for summer. Yeah. Like just chilling. I could. Mm. I would be able to like drink this any other time besides summer, but like on a hot day, you're going in the pool and stuff. Mm -hmm. <sighs> like barbecuing, favorite. making some little micheladas. Oh my Sounds god, we should have been like snacking hot Cheetos and stuff for this. Man, if they even have freaking hot Cheetos right now. All the stores right now are like selling. I'm out sure of they everything. do. Oh my god, oh. put that meme on here of me eating the hot Cheetos and just saying like me and um. Mm -hmm. What is it called? Quarantine? I honestly forgot how it said it. For you like hibernate, not hibernate. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh my god, this coronavirus got me f***ed up because I knew it was serious. I know it's serious. I know it is. It is. But I feel like us people, like, not that we're selfish, but like, we honestly, like, we hear news and it, it does scare us. You don't think it's going to happen around you. And the fact that it's spreading around the United States too, it's like freaking scary. Yeah. And it's just crazy because, you know, anyone can get it. And I know people are saying like, Oh, don't be scared of it. You'll be fine. There's a higher survivor rate, but it's like you really gotta consider the older people, the pregnant people, the people that have like diseases and stuff like that. You know, diabetes, anything like that. Like you really have to like take consideration for people like that. If you were to get the virus and you would be completely fine, your family is still in danger. You know what I mean? Your parents, your grandparents, and anybody. <laughs> well, that's why. Like as much as people say, only these amount of people are dying. It's still somebody dying. Whatever the 2%, 5%, whatever it is, honestly, I'd rather have it at zero. I don't know why people are acting like it's just like, oh, whatever. My bad that you're freaking only 20 and you're not going to get the virus, supposedly. Like, chill. Like, I don't know. Mm-hmm. It's so scary. Okay, so the one thing that I'm, like, so grateful for about this, I mean, not grateful for, like, anything to do with coronavirus. Coronavirus? Coronavirus. <laughs> that your dad has, actually, a lot of hand sanitizer and toilet paper. Yeah, my dad, you guys, so you know how everybody's going crazy? Like, right now, hand sanitizer is gold. So, we yesterday... We were checking online. Somebody was selling, a, like, a little... Yeah, it's like... Oh my god, I don't know. And yesterday, because we had like a little like hand sanitizer that mm. never really came in handy because I'm not ever someone, ever someone that sanitizes my hands. Like, I'm just gonna be honest with you guys. Like, I wash my hands when I have to, when I use the restroom, etc., when I eat. I'm not the kind of person to carry hand sanitizer. The only hand sanitizer you'll ever see me carry is like Bath and Body Works and it'll be like in my keychain, but I don't use it often. Like, I will yeah. not use it often. So, for some reason, my husband has some hand sanitizer. I don't know where he got it from, but he had hand sanitizer. And I actually ended up using it to remove my tape ins because it's alcohol and it's I, I bought it when we went to Vegas. Oh. Yeah. Why'd you buy it? Just because? Because we were going to Vegas. People touching elevated, like it's germs. Oh, the, like we already knew about the coronavirus? Yeah. Oh, I mean, even not saying that, yeah, honestly, you guys, this is something wrong with me, clearly, because even if there was nothing out there, people naturally would carry that, especially traveling, but I'm just a f***ing idiot, apparently. No, I think during that time, it was still, like, all these things happening in China, and we weren't really getting anything out here, until finally, like, oh, like, there's a case in, I don't know what mm -hmm. part, I think it was... It was Chicago and LA, I think were like the first places or something like that. Either way, I was just like at the store and I was like, I'm just gonna buy this just in case. Luckily and we had a little hand sanitizer everywhere. Yesterday, I we found out it was out because I used it to remove my tape yeah. and extension. So that was really selfish of me to not even consider the fact that the world is going to shit shows for 
um, hand sanitizer. Well, honestly, we didn't even know people were gonna go that crazy for hand sanitizer I and toilet paper for some you reason. You hear it on Twitter that people are going crazy, right? Like for the like people were making memes and they're paper. like, it's just funny. I'm like, damn, that's crazy. Wherever that's at, they're out of control. I go to Slater Brothers, <laughs> like literally we went like two days ago. It is chaos. I'm like, wait, this is everywhere, okay? Like, oh, I don't know. It's and insane. that's the crazy thing. Because, okay, everybody's saying, don't go in crowded areas and this and that. There you go building like a freaking three hour line at a store where everybody's going crazy. Probably yelling at one another, I grabbed that toilet paper for you. Like, you're just spitting in their face. Like, it just doesn't make sense to me. It would probably make more sense if, like, they're going to the store and they have, like, little mask on, gloves on, or something. Everybody's just going, like, it's a normal day. I don't know. I guess that's just me. I guess people are freaking out. I get it. I get it. I get it. But, girl, if you're loading up your entire truck yeah. with toilet paper filled in the back, now you're just being selfish because you know no one else is going to get toilet paper. I just have to say it, period. Luckily, they do do that. Like, you could only take a couple of cases now but what sucks is they don't know some families have like bigger families than others you know say for you guys you guys have a big family mm -hmm. when we go and we could only grab two cases is like dude we need about like eight six like at least you know and other families it's just a couple or whatever they no kids it just sucks because some families are bigger than others so they're kind of limited to what they can get but. yeah uh, anyways, we completely forgot about the main thing we we're talking about, which was the hand sanitizer oh, that yeah. was out. He finds the, because we were actually going to go get ramen. We didn't end up getting ramen because it was way too packed. I was looking for a hand sanitizer because I asked someone, like, the one that you have is already empty? He's like, yeah. I mean, I was acting like, I didn't know it was empty because I knew <laughs> I was the one that used all of it's it. It's empty? What? I was like, oh my god, it's empty? <laughs> <laughs> After I f***ing used all my hair. He's like, oh my god, you have one right here. And it was like right on the kitchen counter. So you guys, I'm really really addicted to watching cleaning videos on YouTube I may not be the cleanest person ever my room might be upside down <laughs> half the time but i am very addicted to watching cleaning videos just in general i like looking at people's houses i know this is a little creepy but i like to see how people's layouts are <laughs> i like to see people, how people decorate i'm just like really addicted to those kind of videos so i watch a lot of like cleaning videos and organizing and decorating videos and i've seen a lot of people use like essential oils on their sinks so you know that really satisfying feeling when you wash dishes and you like literally wash your entire sink like if it was a dish like with a soap and everything I think that it's so satisfying and after I see people use like essential oils that they'll drop inside of the sink and they smell so good so not only is your sink spotless but it also brings out that really like pretty scent so I was like oh my god where can I get that so I ended up finding something similar the last time at Stater Brothers and it's actually that one brand and I forget the brand you guys but it's a brand that has like the cleaning is it sprays like Mary's or no, I don't know what is it. Oh my god, you guys will definitely know it's uh, I believe organic. It has like, a lot of pretty different scents. They have like sprays to clean your countertops. They have soaps. I have the countertops, the soaps, and the hand sanitizers. And the hand crazy, sanitizers. <clears throat> that company is actually a little cheaper than like other companies, and we love it because it even smells like really good when you spray it. Yeah, a lot of cleaning videos like a lot of people use that. I ended up buying. A hand sanitizer spray and I would always spray it inside of the sink and it would actually help it would make it smell really really good sorry yeah. good morning moment so anyways it would make it smell really really good so I started using that inside my sink because I could not find an essential oil basically half of it is kind of empty but I mean if you look at it on the bright side it's basically half full so I'm like Okay, we still got hand sanitizer. Yeah. And honestly, hand sanitizer is only like if you're going out and you're grabbing, touching things, use it, you know? When you're at home, you already could wash your hands. You don't need to be wasting hand sanitizer. Use soap and wash it for a good amount of, like, don't just like five seconds of boom. Like, actually, like, screw it. Like, 20 seconds, 35 seconds, whatever. Mm -hmm. Just wash them really good. Yesterday, he told me, I was like, oh my God, perfect. So there I am going out with the little hand sanitizer in my pocket. So we're good with that. And plus it smells like lavender. Amazing. Today, we we're talking about the coronavirus to my family, about what's mm. going on and everything. And mind you, I know we have a lot of toilet paper because my dad used to have a uh, portable restroom business. So he has a <coughs> bunch, a bunch of toilet paper, y'all. Like I'm talking about boxes after boxes filled with toilet paper because obviously you know he he worked in that business and you need toilet paper what i completely forgot about and actually did not know is he has a bunch like a ton yeah. 
of hand sanitizer. And he told us like what he brought, like if you guys saw, uh, Myra snapped about it, I believe, I right? It. Or it Karina. Karina. Karina or Rolo snapped about it. And there was like a good little amount of san hand sanitizers on the counter. And he was like, no, that's just like what I kind of had, like mm -hmm. kind of like in a little bucket. Like 15 hand sanitizers. But he sanitizers. says he still has like boxes and we're just like, He's like, this is we're all good. I got out right now, but he has like a freaking truck filled with like all yeah. this. Cause obviously he had to be stocked up, mm -hmm. you know, when he had this business. He doesn't really do it anymore, but wow. Like he has a bunch of hand sanitizers. And I was yeah. telling my dad, I'm like, you don't understand. Like this is gold right now. Like nobody right now can get their hands on it. And he was like, really? He knows about the coronavirus. My parents watch yeah. the news. They know exactly what like the hell is going on. Kind of knows a little bit about coronavirus. I mean, in fact, they even went to the store today and they were like, there's nothing, yeah. you know? And they were just doing their own regular grocery shopping. <clears throat> well, your dad was even telling me like, he went oh, to one store. they were like in like 10 by 10? Yeah. Well, it so it's like he was going to one store and he grabbed whatever he can and he was like, screw it, let's go try it to another store. So they went to a couple of stores to actually finally get like all the groceries they were kind of looking for. Yet there was some stuff that obviously you guys know they're just completely sold out of. And so it's just like, I don't know, it's, it's crazy. It's crazy what's going on to be honest. It's just insane. Like it doesn't really sink until you actually go to the stores. Like, yeah. It took me for me like, Besides all the tweets that seeing, like it took me to actually see it in person and be like, holy crap, this is real life. It, he has a bunch, so we basically just told, um, or Queen up put it on our story, she was like, family and friends, if y'all need any, let us know, because it's crazy out there, guys. Yeah, it's insane. Like, there's already, it, uh, I don't know. I could not be any more grateful that my dad was like, stocked up like that. Yeah, it came in at the perfect timing. Like I was saying, it's just crazy how many people are like, you guys already know, when Christmas, when Christmas comes around, there's like those videos of people fighting at Walmart and that's going on just for like toilet paper. I don't know. It's, it's just crazy. It's crazy. It's insane. Like what? Like that. It's just crazy. Mm -hmm. I feel like if people didn't over exaggerate with the toilet paper, like there wouldn't be an issue. Yeah. I still don't it's get like, the whole toilet paper thing. Like, like it's not diarrhea, girl. Like what are you doing? Like, yeah. like I get it. If they quarantine us, you have to take a shit. I get it. But you like you, you butt, gotta load up your whole ass truck with it and forget about everyone else. Like girl. Yeah. Could you really have to They're taking that? like years worth of toilet paper. Mm -hmm. I guess somebody overstocked on something, but I guess they couldn't resell it because of some reason. I forgot. I think it was like they were trying to sell it on Amazon, but Amazon's like slightly down for some certain thing. Mm -hmm. The point is they bought a lot of the hand sanitizer and now they can't sell it. So now they're just filled with hand sanitizer at the house. Their main thing was just trying to make money off of it, but they can't. Oh my god, also another thing, I feel like a lot of people keep asking about like the cases and stuff they used to have too. Like you should definitely oh my god. on that. A lot of, I mean, it's very clear that a lot literally, like I'm talking about a lot of brands to get their things from China. Yeah. Like that's just reality. I'm talking about like really known brands out there that you guys purchase from. You name uh, it, that it's from China. It doesn't matter no how matter bougie the brand is. Yeah. Almost everything is made in China, period. So if y'all want to come for real cases, I'm oh telling y'all right now, everything comes from China, period. Right now, it's just like, it's such a scary time. I don't even think a lot of things are being shipped from China, period. Like, everything's on hold. So, on top of us trying to, like, rebrand the cases, it's like, oh, now the coronavirus is happening, and it's like... It's scary. It's, I, well, like, why? we were even trying to, like, kind of do, like, a whole little shipment thing. But during that, we were just like, do we want to risk it just, like actually ordering something from like where everything is coming from. Sadly, the virus is mainly in China. So were we gonna try to risk bringing something from over there over here? I don't know, it was just scary. We just kind of held back on that. And then now obviously it's even worse than what it was before. So even pla like places are closing down. Like, I don't know, mm -hmm. it's crazy. Overall, the whole real case is gonna be held back for a good little minute until everything kind of cools down, I guess you could say. Like even the school's closing down, like Jasmine. Oh my and God, Jasmine have to do and like school online schooling. Down. Like everything that's happening is <laughs> that's like crazy. making me feel more like, oh shit, this is really happening. Oh my God, this is actually really, really going down. Yeah. Like, oh my God, that's it's happening. How many beers have you drink? Um. No, you haven't. Don't tell me you've drank already two beers. No. One two, two? two and a half. Two and a half. Well, kind of and a half. Look. Like, I'm oh just, my god! I'm just three just to... Boom. I'm like barely on my fucking first one. Oh, can I know because I need to? I'll yeah. blur it out. Okay. Oh my god! I know, you guys. I actually do bleep out when I cuss on my channel. Too. I'll be like, no, my I think channel. I just don't have a problem not cussing. Okay, shade all at me. <laughs> and honestly, <laughs> okay, like I'm doing a full on drinking. Like obviously, this is not for no one under. I don't what know. is that? Is that a bottle opener? 
This is from Nothing Sweet, yo. Oh, that's so cool. Shake it, shake it, shake it. What are they saying? Tell me when. Oh, about how like, your brother and sister are doing like online schooling now. Oh, yeah. We love private schools. I don't know. Like, I know it's funny or, you know, people like to make things like jokes on Twitter. And like, I will get a good laugh out of it. I will. No, definitely. You know, like, the memes, the <laughs> the memes, memes are funny. I'm just being the, honest, like, there's got to be some humor and crazy shit like this. Sometimes. Well, that's why. Honestly, for me, look. Any comedy, you know it's joking not to take serious. Some people are going to get butthurt about it, but in every comic thing, that's what it is, you know? You're making fun of something, and yeah, certain things do take a little bit too far, I'm not making fun of it directly. I, I Let me just clarify before people think weird about it. Okay. I was seeing the memes of it, like, supposedly, like, class of 2020, and they're graduating. Yeah, graduating like, that's, that's funny. I'm sorry, that's, like, funny. Well, that's I mean, funny. would it be funny when it's actually happening? Absolutely not. Like, oh my god, they didn't get to experience walking? Like, that is sad. Or, like, prom 2020? Like, girl, like, the memes of it all. Like, it is funny. Obviously, would we like for it to actually happen? No. But, like, Twitter is on a whole other level of humor if you guys yeah. do not have twitter girl i mean no but some twitter people will be making, some people don't know how to take jokes i'm just if, gonna say that if you don't if you can't take jokes twitter's not for you no period twitter has like Stay the home. craziest like two extremes sometimes i'm like okay y'all are crossing the line right now yeah i need a little spoon i'll be back might want to go grab a little spoon for the <clears throat> what is this what is it called um i know this is like michelada mix but that like um oh my god what is this chamoy Right? Yeah, it's made with chamoy, but like, is it like a specific word for it? Like, oh my god, I don't know. I feel like Natalia did. What was that your second one? Yeah, they're really, really good. Mm. I just don't know how many michelas I could have. I feel like I'm good with one, like in the summer when I'm not trying to get like buzzed. Mm -hmm. On a good night where I'm trying to get lit, I might need a few. But I don't know, I feel like I'm more of a shots person. Like, well, no, you know what? It's crazy, but like, for I, myself, when I start drinking, like, say a michelada or a mixed drink, I feel like that's just the starter, you know, just to like kind of get you there. But then after that, you're like, give me a shot. I don't even I think feel I it might anymore. do shots for my channel, deadass. Do you have liquor? <laughs> we don't have. Oh, we do. Making, oh, I was gonna say I'm over here making plans, but I'm like. We could do still some more micheladas mm -hmm. and then some liqueur. That'd be fun. Yeah. I haven't done a video with you in forever <clears throat> on my channel, actually. You're the one that never wants to, so. Never wants to? Boy, what? you got me f***ed up. Never wants to. I'm just f***ing trying to film beauty <laughs> shit. You can actually came out of my last video for that. Did I? My cooking one? Oh, yeah, yeah. We made some tacos. Mm -hmm. That was bomb. That was really good. Have you guys done anything specifically? Like, are any of you guys the hoarding people that are getting, like, toilet paper or hand sanitizer? Or are any of you guys actually, actually struggling to grab some stuff? Because I feel like there's a lot of people that are actually struggling to, like, even for, like, a normal day thing. Like, the yeah. other day, like, Luis was just like, we just literally need just some milk for the kids. And... It's hard because the whole freaking stores are packed with people and they're just grabbing anything and any, like whatever it is mm -hmm. just to have something at the house, you know? And for other people that actually do need specifically for like something. Sad. Yeah, oh yeah. For anybody with kids right now, people in the medical field, that must be super hard right now because you know you're dealing directly with the people with or possibly with the virus, you know? Mm -hmm. Why don't we finish this and then because I want to start with mine with these. Oh, okay. I just want to first of all say that I'm so proud of his vlogs. I mean, not vlogs. <laughs> Sorry, his mukbangs because I feel like Brian at first when he would upload, he didn't really know like what direction he was going and he's had his channel for well, a couple years. No, I, I've had it for uh, more. But I feel like when I first started, I was trying to make videos, but a certain someone, I'm not gonna say who or point or anything, but I couldn't prank them because they just wouldn't like my videos. I didn't get that world, now I get it. It's like funny, okay. Anyways, the whole point, I'm actually being pretty consistent of myself, I, I guess. I'm pretty proud of myself as well, so thank you. Hopefully you guys are enjoying it as well, I don't know. I still see it like, um, obviously nobody, but. No, I think actually, first of all, if you go through his older videos, like he really didn't, like you could tell, he, I mean, I think he didn't really know exactly what to post. Cause you know like channels have like a, kind of like a theme. Like for me, I have a beauty channel, right? Like a category? Or like lifestyle or like, you know, and I think Brian was more lifestyle, but it was also mm -hmm. some sit down videos. Like, I don't know, but a lot of lifestyle people do sit downs. I don't know, like the point is that he started getting really into mukbangs and just recently he started like posting, <clears throat> 
consistently because he said his channel for a few years and like just till now he started being consistent and it's actually been working out like i genuinely get in like, forget it ah <sighs> okay am i getting lit already like <laughs> I, what the hell yeah i think you're already drunk i think they lit off one beer damn I don't know. am i that lightweight maybe honestly another thing too a lot of people would always tell me like you should try mukbangs because you for myself yeah, like, it's funny too because I'll get this question a lot. How could you eat and still, like, not be fat or whatever? This is, like, how I normally eat, I guess you could say. <laughs> like, I'm not, like, really trying to change anything. Obviously, when I do mukbangs, I do order, like, an extra little here and there. Most of the time, I still finish a good amount of it. But, like, I'm not doing anything, like, super crazy out of my ordinary. Like, I don't normally eat just one taco and, like, oh, like, just for the mukbang, I'm going to get 20. No, yeah. like, I, I do eat a lot. And I feel like that was the reason why people were like, no, like, do mukbangs. Like, you'll do really good at it. Yeah, like, I don't think y'all understand, but, like, Brian could eat. Like, this was for Brian. Like, mukbangs were, like, his thing since day one and he didn't realize it until now. <laughs> but he eats, like, a lot. And, like, I think it's honestly Enjoy doing really good like for him you could say he barely started like being consistent mm -hmm. he would post like once every six months like yeah he would never post mm -mm. and like finally i feel like you know he'll he he would like not even tell me he was just like okay i gotta film today like he already has his like schedule. i already yeah he already has like things written down like okay my next book bond is gonna be this so like like literally now see. like random like oh babe come here and like and she's like what like look i already edited blah blah like just like how do you look like think it looks yeah. or whatever or how do you it look or, like how do you think this thumbnail looks is it cool is that and she was like yeah yeah boom like okay boom i upload and that's it you know yeah this is on videos those on thumbnails like he doesn't really ask me for help like at all with it and i feel honestly and it's just crazy seeing hold on i'm so sorry i hate to put him <laughs> no, off no you're good but it's so weird because like obviously for like our vlog channel like he edits the videos and stuff but like mm -hmm. a lot of the times i feel like i'm very just like very hands-on without me knowing like i would not be able to just trust someone to edit the videos and just post them i'm very very hands-on with things like that for me to not help him like at all with uh his channel it's just like weird i'm like oh my god he's actually getting the hang of it and he's doing his own thing he knows how to edit things out if that doesn't go in the you know what i mean there's a certain way of editing where sometimes it's like okay that's not necessary to and everybody's video. different at editing too yeah like, thanks to that like helping her edit with her her beauty video and the vlog it helped me out to like now I my channel I completely have full control over it I'm not like I don't know how to edit or I don't know how to do a thumbnail I don't know how to even upload certain people honestly try to start off the channel and they don't know how and they'll even some people even ask me like they'll DM me or they'll comment like oh like I just want to start a channel now and did this and that and honestly go for it it's freaking I, I like it it's dope but I'm loving it. I'm hopefully you guys like my mukbangs. I don't know. I actually love his mukbangs. I got really excited with your um, Maruchan with Hot Cheetos. Because if you guys saw, like, I got to try it on the video. I was so it's excited bomb. to see the video because it looks so good. Oh I my god. Like I, I enjoy watching him eat. Like, I actually, that day, I'm like, I just want to sit down and, like, watch you eat. Because I it's, can't. like, something about mukbangs is so fascinating to me. Like, I love seeing people. And Brian doesn't just, like, eat, like, little. No, he'll eat like a lot and that's why i say like i feel like mukbangs are made for him because he's someone that actually since day one that i've known him i just have never i have never understood why he's like thin because he eats he eats like so much like if i eat like him i would be like five times bigger than i am right now <laughs> like i just don't understand i'm like how is this even possible like how does that even fit in your stomach no but I since know. i was younger i've always had like a fast metabolism can't fucking relate and that's not what know. Obesity. It's so cute like seeing him grow and how excited he gets like, to film the videos. Oh my god, that's so mm. cute. I've been enjoying like almost every single one of my mukbangs. The only one that actually still affect me the day after was a KFC donut one. Like oh. that day eating it, I already kind of felt like sick. Even to the next day, like I just felt like nasty. Like I don't know, I just, it was just the worst combination KFC could have sadly done, you know? Mm -hmm. You had so much hope for it, but no bueno. You good? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I feel like I could tell already. Myers like kind of. Oh my god! How do you, how could you tell? It's just something in. What it. the? F That's so weird. I don't know how. I'm really like it's barely one and a half. Like how am I feeling buzzed already? That's so weird. But you know what? We don't really drink. We like, drink a lot when we have can. When. Well, yeah. Well, when no. Ha when we have like parties, like only we when drink. we have parties, yeah. we could drink. We don't drink every day. Like we'll drink once a month or less. 
than that. Because I feel like every vlog is us drinking and they assume that we're drinking all the time, but that's like just me recording like pure parties. Yeah. But what y'all don't know is like those parties are like separate. I don't know. Right now, events are kind of canceled because of the whole corona coronavirus. I know right now with the coronavirus. <laughs> no, stop. I'm messing up. I could tell. I know right now with the coronavirus. <laughs> shut up. <laughs> Okay, you know what? I'm out completely. I know right now with the coronavirus, like a lot of events are like not happening. On a regular, like if I go to events and stuff, then I'll drink like twice a week or three times, depending. I mean, depending on like if I go, because events mm -hmm. are very often. So if I go to three events in a week, I'll probably not drink in like one of them. If they're very consistent, I know to tell myself like you're yeah, not going to but... drink at <clears> the <throat> event. Yeah, but see, also during events, it's sometimes only just like those couple of hours in an event, so you don't drink like yeah, you'll like, have like one party. drink. Like, well, that's why. That's why you'll have that like one, two drinks or whatever. You, you know? only get lit at those like parties that you see that are like going on for hours, and you can just tell like every influencer is drunk. Yeah, yeah. I'm already gonna finish this one, you I'm not. I'm still not done yet. I can't wait to see how it looks like. This. <sighs> when did you finish this? Huh? I forgot. How about this? Just pound it so we could just end this one. Because it's going to end right now too again. We'll restart the shit because I am chugging this down in the next minute. <laughs> and then like it just cuts <laughs> off. Like <laughs> That would happen. Are you going to pound it off? I don't know if I could do that. Dude, oh, go all the way, all the way, all the way. Oh, so close. I told him to ask me <laughs> questions on my phone, so <clears throat> hopefully they're asking some juicy ones. Also, don't forget to follow Latin Sweets, yo. Thank you, Latin Sweets, for the bottle opener. Loving it. Dunskis. Woo! <laughs> I feel like you're like I more than like you. the small buzz, you're like there, you know? No, guys, I swear to God. <laughs> Pause. It's only two beers. You know what's so crazy? I'm actually I, like when I go out, I drink a lot of shots, so I'm not used to beer. Maybe, I, but then again, like you would think but shots are stronger. What? I don't get it. No, yeah, but you know what? I it's crazy, but like sometimes beer and all, it, it hits different. It hits because different. Because I could like take a shot and I'll be like fine. I'll drink like two, three beers and I'll be like, oh it's wow, just, like, it's Corona extra. That's why. I, I don't get it. Or is there like a Corona only? No. They're that's, all Corona extra? That's when you know she's already been drinking. Wait, they're all Corona extra? <laughs> yeah. Well, no. there's all either Corona extra or Corona light. That's and Corona, why. No, but Corona light is like the diet one that they like came out with or whatever. Oh, I thought Corona light was like less alcohol. It is, huh? I, I, I he's can't. Trying to, he's trying to, he's trying to <laughs> mess with me. Corona light is less alcohol. <laughs> Oh my god. Corona Extra is probably stronger, huh? <laughs> if you guys think she's drunk. Oh my god, I'm not. Go I'm cringing because I'm not, guys. I'm buzzed, but I'm, I don't get it. Mm -hmm. I don't understand. I'm like your mom. Your mom could drink like half a beer and she's like... Oh, my mom, she pops a beer open and just from that little mist coming up, she's wasted. I don't understand, guys. Like, I could drink like <laughs> two, three shots and then if I, like, I'll be fine with like I two beers. Know. You drink three beers. Like, what is the reason? Well, it's only three beers. But oh, we're going to drink more from my channel. Comment down below. Corona Extra has more alcohol. Please tell me they're stronger because I'm feeling something. Like, I'm not sober. What's the amount of beers that gets you drunk? We'd love to know that. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And also check out my babe's channel, My Artistic Glam. And we're we're going to do a Q&A. Yeah. We're going to answer some juicy questions. Might talk about our little life update. I don't even know. Should we talk about that? About what was going on? I mean, if they ask it, why not? Okay. I mean, isn't it crazy? First of all, it didn't even confirm. Let's uh, have to look, stay tuned. We'll just, yeah, let's just, all right. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Ugh. Damn, you are you buzzed too? No, sorry. <laughs> Doesn't everybody every now and then just get a little... Okay, tough sorry. Tough? You could have probably thought that for me too when I was messing up. Doesn't that some people <laughs> no. mess up too? We'll see you guys in Myra's channel. Deuces.